What's up, Funkaholics? I'm ready for giveaway. He talks. So talented. I'm giving away the flocked bug, Bugs Bunny that was on and gone from the Target site in seconds. So much so that I had to buy two on eBay. One of them were for you guys. So if you're interested, if you're new here and you want to enter the Bugs Bunny uh, giveaway, please go ahead and subscribe. Hit uh, the notification bell, which is next to the subscription button. If you feel like it, give me a thumbs up. I could really use that. And then uh, make a comment so I know who you are and I can put your name into the drawing. That's the way to enter. Um, so the drawing goes until the end of the month and I will be announcing a surprise drawing probably over the weekend maybe. I'm not really sure. Still got to find my bag. <laughs> but anyways, today I have collector's case collector's case. Can you see it? It's really big <laughs> and it's hefty. But I've learned this week that hefty does not equal good. So anyways, I've already cut it open. I did not look. I'm going to have Bill help me. Is there paper? Okay. Mm -hmm. Can I see it? Yep. Okay. Are they smiling or laughing or Confused like I am. I don't know what it is. <laughs> Everybody's confused these days. Okay, well, let me see. I don't know what it is either. Oh. I think I know what it is. No, I don't know. I always do the t-shirt first. I know a lot of people save it, but I want to see the damn t-shirt. Friends wouldn't, friends don't lie. Ah, we know what this is from. And you can probably see because her name is right there. It's 11. And there's an ego. And there is what Mike told her when they first started their little um, forced relationship. And he told him, friends don't lie. She has since learned that Sometimes people do lie. It's all philosophical and stuff. I won't get into it. But I love this t-shirt. William and I will share it because that's what we do. The next thing. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, I love this. It's a little miniature Polaroid camera world's coolest Polaroid. And it's actually a, a keychain. And it says that it has sound and simulated film. I was a photographer. I am a photographer and I was since I was in junior high school. I have never seen simulated film. I've only seen film or no film. I don't know. But it's just as cute as can be. <laughs> this might have to be something I keep. Look cute on my wall. If I have any walls left after all the pops get put into place. Ah, oh, there's a pop in here and it's, you know what? This is a, um, this is a Stranger Things themed pop uh, box. And we could have definitely gotten a better pop because they sent us a common Brenner. I don't mean to be ungrateful at all. <laughs> I do have one in my set. So I'll put this one up for uh, trade or you never know where he's going to belong. Here he's going to end up. A few minutes if I don't get something better. He's ending up out in the backyard with the squirrel. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, it's this is cool. This is from the very first wave. No, no. 
Well, yeah, no, I don't know. Yeah, I think it's from the first wave. It was one of those I just kept waiting and waiting to buy because, you know, I thought he'd always be there. And sure enough, he uh, jumped the devil. Oh, pins? Are these pins? Oh, these are plugs. Designer shoe charms. Oh, my pins. There's two sets. These are really cool, though. Designer, they're called plugs. I don't know if they keep your shoes tied. Yeah, it just says designer. No, the name of the company is Plugs. That what they say they are are designer shoe charms. Shoe charms. And you know they're all upside down. This one's a lion. That one's a monkey. You know, when you put something in a box to ship it. It just goes all crazy on you. Well, anyways, if you can see them, um, the top one looks to be an, a rhino. And then below the rhino, I'm not quite sure what that, I'm not sure what that is. There is a tiger, a lion, and a monkey. Oh my. Okay. The second set. Um, these are so cute. I wish they weren't on their heads. Can you open it and close it back? Oh. Oh. Hold on. You can. Okay. This is so much better. Okay, guy. It's time to set up and be noticed. Okay. This set as you can see, is a cute little turtle, a majestic bald eagle. Is that a rat? Yeah, he's got cheese. He's a rat. And a cute little frog. Uh, I think that's a, a alligator. Um, should I take these out and let them seem better? I think, you know, I'm just going to put them back. They're adorable. I wouldn't probably use them, so these might go into my surprise giveaway box. Do you think I should? I, you know, my, I, I collect sneakers, but they're collectible sneakers, and I, I wear some of them, like, every once in a while. I've got, like, Green Lantern. The Beatles, Jimi Hendrix, um, I've got some, oh, geez, I've, I've probably got like 10, 15 pairs of collectible shoes, and then a few, uh, sneakers, and then a few that um, I wear that I just slip on. I, I just got a pair of Skechers, and I just can slip them right on. There's no ties, no nothing in it. It's just easier for me. Since my body wants to hit the ground every chance it gets. Oh. Okay, well. This is just like um, an out in the field <laughs> type of thing. It's the uh, Nostromo collection, the alien, the Nostromo collection, which I would assume means it is from the original film where the Nostromo gets completely destroyed by Ripley. Having destroyed it, one of them come with her. She destroys it too because she's badass. That's probably one of the most badass characters that is a woman uh, action adventure character. Although, Alice from the uh, uh, Resident Evil films is pretty badass herself. Oh, oh, oh. I'm moving. I'm moving. We got probably the one character I would really want out of it the most. And that is the um, Xenomorph, I believe is what they end up calling him. 
him, her, whatever. If you don't already know, um, the, um, there's two out of 20. I don't know why they do that. It means one out of 10. So out of every 10 boxes, you'll probably get one. There's two, um, surprise, there's a surprise Ripley and a surprise Ash. And the others are Ripley in a space suit, uh, face hugger, uh, Kane with a, with a face hugger on his face, then a regular Ripley and an egg. How cool would the egg be? The egg is uh, 1 in 20. So this guy is so cool. He's going to go in there. I was telling you that the... Uh, there is a six inch pop of the alien queen, the one that um, almost does Ripley and Newt in at the end of the movie. So I don't know it's how hard it is to get now. I got it when I first started collecting just because I, I couldn't, couldn't believe there are all these horror fi um, figures. When I started collecting, there was already the Reagan, um, the, um, no, Annabelle came later. Ghostface, uh, Saw, um, Michael Myers, Jason, Freddy. There were already those figures out. Uh, I'm pretty sure most of those were already out. So I was like, wow. And I, that was like when I really got into collecting was um, there. It was very cool to get those. So, so this is an official Funko product. Yes. Or is it Tartan? Titan. Titan. Tartan, Titan. But it does not say Funko anywhere. Oh well. It's still a nice little item. His head is so big. It would have been kind of cool to have his mouth open and his other mouth coming out. But whatever. I'm very happy with him. Okay. No hiding him away for yourself. We love that movie. Oh, oh, oh. Cool. Stranger Things. I can't wait for that, that show to start up for season three. They're going to be in high school. They're going to be much... They're going to have much more knowledge than any child their age should about how the world could really be if you consider the Demogorgon to be the bad guy on earth in your life and your mother to be the good person it off it all figures out okay so we are broken in already and we have our little baggie Someone said the on, online the other day, it looks like a trash bag. It kind of does. This could be your Barbie trash bag. <laughs> open, open, open. I ripped up your Barbie trash bag. I got Lucas. Lucas is kind of the voice of reason, although he just doesn't get it for way too long. But he does, um, he is the one, he's kind of their id. They're like, come on now, this can't be real. We don't know this girl. She just appeared out of nowhere. He's really, really cute. And in this uh, pose from this scene, he's actually starting to say, holy crap. This could really be something going on because he's been watching and he's been listening. And yeah, he, he's starting to think, hmm, maybe the girl's for real. And that's even after he's seen all she can, some of what she can do. So, you know, naysayers are naysayers always until they see it themselves. Thank you. Um, there is... Two things left. There are two things left. One, 
2018 trading card preview, non-sport update. Wubba lubba dub dub. Rick and Morty's on the cover. Did you get a free card? Usually stuff like this gives you a free card. Maybe there's some inside. It kind of feels... <laughs> Can someone please, please tell me, why does Rick throw up all the time or spit or drool? I watched the the I watched a little bit of one cartoon because Bill was looking around the inner the he's he's one of those guys who just can't help himself and I saw a Rick and Morty and I'm like stop stop go back and is it float <laughs> so it was pretty funny so yeah now I like Rick and Morty it's um Rick and Morty trading cards season one that's why they're on the cover that's probably the big announcement for the year cryptozoic entertainment is proud to present a set of trading cards based on rick and morty look for randomly inserted autographs and sketch cards they didn't even give us a pack I might be inside the oh i don't want to have to open it well and if i do and then i don't know it doesn't say there's any in there Auction results. Three Stooges fetch $15,000. Mars attacks nets over $5,000. Okay, so we spent our whole lives throwing away <laughs> our collector's cards. I don't know. Should I open it? I'm torn. It doesn't say there is. I'm going to think about it because... There is a limited edition promo card inside. Star Trek Deep Space Nine heroes and villains and Rick and Morty. God help me, I'm going to open it. I'm sorry, I have to see that. And I I don't know, I might want to keep it. I don't know. I used to collect used to collect baseball cards. I was going to put my kids through college. Well, my daughter went through college to the tune of well over two hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> no, Annie's. I don't know if Annie's in debt. I think Aunt Annie's dad, my youngest aunt, it, she paid for her own. Um, I just have an envelope in the middle of the car, in the middle of the thingy. Annie, Annie's dad paid for her, and. Brennan, my son, has finally decided what he wants to do with his life, and he's going to school to be an RN. Go, Brandon. You're the best. You're the best son. Okay, so I have, uh, I found an envelope. Oh, what's that? It's a card, so you can subscribe. You know, I might keep this and subscribe. How much is the subscription? Uh, one year is $25. And how often do you get it? Six issues. So it's bi-monthly. Okay. I'm going to look at this card. <laughs> oh, gosh. Why do they have it like that? There's two. Star Trek Deep Space Nine Heroes and Villains Trading Cards. I have never watched Deep Space Nine in my life. Big fan of the original series, though. And Anatomy Park. <laughs> it's supposed to look like Jurassic Park. <laughs> and this is a promo card. Is this a promo card? Autograph cards and one metal card per box. Lord help me, I feel it coming on. <laughs> so this one is adorable. It's called Anatomy Park and it's Rick and Morty. And it's a takeoff on Jurassic Park. We just watched Jurassic World for I don't know how many times last night. Um, 
We're really movie people here. And this is a promo card. Coming in 2018, look for randomly inserted autographs and sketch cards. Well, I think I'm going to keep them. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry, sorry. If it had been an autograph one, I, that probably would have been worse. Um, I feel bad, but I'm going to keep this, and I want, I want the book. I feel so greedy. Ghoul of my dreams. Monster mavens get stuck on Frankenstein Valentine sticker. What month? This is February, March. Okay, this is a brand new one. But, um, so those were Valentine's Day stickers that we didn't get to get. You know, I wonder if they'll have any of these. What are you doing? Oh, the first thing, the very first thing I thought was, oh my God, that, that, alien the alien is loose in the house, drooling everywhere. You know, do to me what you want, but don't drool thick shit, thick stuff in my house. I swear like a truck driver, you guys probably think I'm a, I'm a lady. <laughs> I learned that from uh, friends, I'm sure. Ah. You know, this is just, oh my gosh, this has prices and everything. Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix update. Complete set. $12.50. And you spend $50 to get the complete set. Okay, I need to stop. I'm going to put this away. Don't bend it. It is my new obsession. Golden half. There's one. Beside the... Um, there's one more thing. <laughs> I didn't watch Seinfeld at all, but I did see this episode in rerun because everybody was talking about how funny it is. And it was very funny. And is this a, this is a vinyl idol. Dorbs. No, it's not a Dorbs. It's a vinyl idol. Oh. I wish it were Dorbs. And this is the Soup Nazi. Look at his ladle. He's about ready to deny you your soup. No soup for you. <laughs> soup Nazi. This is adorable. And yet, has a little ding on the corner there. However, are you attached to this? You like it? Surprise giveaway. It's just easier this way. My 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 bag is somewhere. We we've been trying to get. Run away. I could have run away. I would if I could. <laughs> we just always try to like organize the pops, and the DVDs, and, and the pens, and it just gets away from us. And then we get tired. We're old. Then we get tired. It doesn't happen. Who wants the soup Nazi? Any. Any uh, fans of um, Seinfeld out there? This is an official Seinfeld Soup Nazi from Vinyl Sugar. That's a cute name. Bill, I don't want you to listen to this. Made in Vietnam. Can you believe that? Actually, things made in Vietnam are very sturdy. I think they're better than things made in, in um, China, but that's just me. Okay, so this is up for grabs. We will be taking entries starting now. And those entries will be going until blah, 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 blah. Let's say, how long? A week. Bill says a week. So next Friday, we will have the drawing if, if I have at least 10 people. I need some people and people who join, who, 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 um, people who sign up or register for my site and then leave when they don't win suck. What would it hurt you? Oh, the phone's ringing. I don't care. Oh, that's your, that's uh, miss an appointment? not that I know of. I don't have an appointment until sometime. Well, we'll catch you on the flip flop.
Anyways, people who register or subscribe and leave when they don't win suck. What would it hurt you to stay and maybe win next time? I, I know it's because I'm long-winded, you don't like me, whatever. But don't win my drawing and then leave, or don't not win and then leave. Well, I don't want to be a woman. Boots in the house. <laughs> but I, I'm just saying, it really irritates me, and it irritates a lot of... Excuse me. <laughs> it irritates a lot of, of YouTubers, because we work hard to do these videos. Um, we work hard to figure out a video. I'm pretty lucky because I know when something comes in the house, I have to do a video. That triggers it. But enough rant. So, so here's what we have in um, the box and what we could have had. Oh, I didn't get it. I didn't get an autograph. Life is cruel. Okay. The non sports card. Oh, it's a. Beckett. It's a Beckett. Beckett is the, the company that does the uh, price guide and magazine form, just like this one for sports cards. So, uh, get your pop culture trading card fix inside this monthly, this month's Beckett non-sports magazine. The, the, this, the issue also in, comes with bonus trading cards. And uh, it actually has one of the cards that, that I got. Uh, Funko Stranger Things. We got that. You have a one in five possibility to score. Wait, wait. Celebrate the second season of Stranger Things. The second season, really, of Stranger Things with one of five possible pops to score in your case this month. Plus a chance to score the hoop, the the hopper chase. You know what? I want that one. That's the only the only thing I need for my whole set. Um, uh, tell us who you got. I'm not telling you crap. Okay, February's okay. Vinyl Funko Vinyl Idols. Oh, it is a Funko product. Um, Seinfeld Soup Nazi. No soup for you. So I'll keep going. Titan Vinyl Figure Allen. Alien from the classic from the classic 1979 sci-fi movie Alien comes the mini vinyl figures. So um, I got an I got the Xenomorph, so that's pretty cool. The Eleven T-shirt is called Egos and Friends. Your Stranger Thing collection would not be uh, would not be complete without this T-shirt. Okay, what a surprise! This month, there is a chance to receive a signed autograph from either Gat <clears throat> excuse me, Gatton, Mad Mad I can never pronounce his name. His he he's Dustin, uh, Kayla McLaughlin, who is Lucas, or Finn Wolfhard, who is Mike, from the hit series Stranger Things, which we did not get. April's case. Um, case 23. Snap, tag, and share. It's not saying what it is. It's got Daredevil. Oh, this is, a, okay, March. This is a different case. Case 23, case 24. Oh, okay, this is February's case. March is Daredevil. And then April is somebody I don't know, but he's very attractive. Is that the guy in Legion? Is that the guy in Legion? Well, we're at a complete... The show based on no, no, the TV show based on Legion. Okay, well, we watched it. Her name is Charlie. No, Legion is like in its second or third season. Okay, I'm annoyed, and I'm going to go. So anyways, we, we now have two drawings to give away. One is only lasting a week, and 
I just want you to know it's extremely difficult for me to run two drawings at once because of my bipolar and um, today I'm, I'm having a hard time but I'm trying to fight through it. I had to do this this um, re this opening. Anyways, so we've got the bugs, which ends the last day of the month or the first day of April, and then we have the um, the uh, one week Snoop Snoop Nazi. <laughs> I just made him a rapper, Soup Nazi. So now I've run thirty minutes. I apologize. I apologize. I apologize. It, I feel like I have to explain everything so well. It's the teacher in me that it's the wanted to be teacher in me. All right, guys, I love you. I hope you have a great bunch of hunts over the weekend. And please be, um, please tell me what you get over the weekend. When you get something, if you don't have a channel that I subscribe to, then then put it, you know, on in my comments. If you do have a channel, then um, tell me in the comments that I should subscribe to your channel because I try to subscribe to as many channels as I can. And I enjoy your channels. Okay, I'm going now. Bye. Love you.